So yeah, they killed my cat too. Just like this. Didn't seem to have any, uh, seemed to not have any little like sign of what happened or whatnot, right? It just passed away, they couldn't tell you. As far as I'm concerned on the autopsy, they said the cat was strangled to death. So yeah, what's going on is like, I have sex traffickers in my house, killing my mom and cat. Now they went as far to kill my dog and then it's the little city, it's like a ghost town, has people revving their engines when they kill my dog and crap. Act like they're, they're not all in on it, so it's all these little time. Watch out for Freemasonry, whatever. They're all mad at me, whatever the hell it is. Want well, to get the like kill alarms and cats, and that's that. It's not why I really came here to talk about though. I want to like actually get my last moments with my dog, but I just want to say, no way. It's natural. My dog's very hyper, energetic, healthy, give it water and food all the time. To totally bring it in. So I think that just because you make one mistake doesn't mean you should, your dog should die. Okay? I don't even think it's a mistake anyways. I bring it out because they told me not to bring the dog in. So they can make it so I can't see what's going on with everything. And they can steal my jacket to whatever it is. But sometimes it's just like that. They make problems and I'll hire nobody else. Just like little like. It's like some Mexican people. Not to be racist. I'm just going to say what it is. Like, there's no black people in the city. So, I hope I can actually get the camera. The camera's just going to show my dog what happened, you know? So, y'all help me get the camera. It's some Santa Maria 805 stuff. 99 cent store. If you guys get that camera going, try to ask them what's up with that. They said that they would. They don't know how to do it. I'm assuming that they even called the police to do it. So yeah. All together, yeah, this is not what I actually planned for. I'm assuming we should've just never went to the 99 cent store, okay? Should've just uh, kept going the other way. So yeah, I think someone like, killed our dog, definitely. We have like agents all over on our job. We're not even allowed to talk about the truth either, so it's like, don't want to lie on this team. Assuming it could be my own family ganging up against me, killing my dog, but, uh, it's whatever. There's plenty of gang stalkers, but they're like, I'm trying to say, like, my family's sending them at us. It says people punching rubes in their house. They're doing the same nasty stuff that made us leave anyways. They threatened to, uh, steal my dog, sell my dog, or whatever it was, right? Some Sean Thomas fools are registered sex offenders. As far as I'm concerned, we're doing all this because of that. I won't blame it on that. So I don't need to be doing any of that baloney stuff. So all that, they're trying to lead up to that. Well, they're just trying to lead up to that. That's all it ever was. It's all like all that ever was. All this is, all right? All this cuts and scars, all this baloney makes me cost all this money and crap. For a registered sex offender and an illegal immigrant to be in my house. It's pretty stupid, I mean. And I just kill my dog. You have little legals follow me on bikes all the time, too. I'm assuming they strangled my dog because someone strangled my cat to death. That's what the autopsy supposedly said. If that was the truth, that was the truth. And then we'll see. So see on camera, though. I don't want to say something that ain't true, but definitely they'll even let us see on camera and then I'll just try to plop us in the hospital or something just for trying to say like what we actually think it is.